Hey, this is from Rao London, and you're watching I Love Live TV, and I'm joined by the wonderful Baby Soul. How you doing? Hey, I'm fine, thank you. Do you look so energetic and ready for today? So, for those who may not know much about you, tell us a little bit about yourself and your music. Um, what can I say? I am a uh, singer songwriter, um, jazz influenced, soulful, I hope, and uh, I love me a little bit of reggae. Okay. So, uh, I try to sort of uh, fuse those three elements in my musical style. Nice, nice. Well, we've had you here before, and in that time, you've done so much. You, you was at Glastonbury and doing loads of festivals. I've never done I Love Live before. This is my first time. I'm sure I've seen your I Love Live before I've many been times. I've here often, but I haven't actually performed. This is my Are you serious? First time performing at I Love Live. Yeah. What? I've seen you on stage. Well, that's because other people have been doing things, and I've been doing things with them. Like, right. I was here at I Love Live uh, with uh, Matty P. Okay, yeah. When he did his I Love Live performance, I was present. I did his backing vocals for him. Um, I love him. And, uh, and Lazy Habits. Yeah. Um, Lazy Habits were on, and um, I feature on one of their tracks called uh, Memory Banks. Actually, I'm sort of in parts all over the album. But, um, uh, yeah, they did their I Love Live performance not too long ago, and I just turned up, and they went... <laughs> Baby Soul, Baby Soul's in the house, Baby Soul. And I was like, and then got off on the stage. And that, that, might, have, that might have been where you might have seen me. I think that's what it is. We've just become so familiar with your face at I Love Live. It, it's only right that we had to have you on the lineup. I'm so pleased that <laughs> you thought that might be a good idea. It is a good idea. So how do you feel about being at I Love Live today? Um, I'm a little bit nervous, but only because it's, you know, um, only because it's quite uh, an industry focused night I've found so um, I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit scared of industry people no offense um, <laughs> um, funnily enough even though I'm in it myself and it's the industry that I want to be in um, it's very much like you, you people look at you and then they're taking their time to sort of like digest and think about what's going on do you know what I mean but that can sometimes come across as hating you no, so, none of that. It's yeah. all love oh, at no, I Love Life. I know, I know it's all love. But you know, when you're on stage and you're uh, doing your thing, uh, it can be nerve-wracking at the best of times. So when you look out into an audience of faces looking back at you, it's nice when they know who you are or they've seen you before or, or they're not looking. <laughs> because then at least that way you can sort of like, you know, interact with those that are smiling. And if they're not looking, then they're not looking. It's fine. They like you, they like you. They don't like you, they don't. But the thing is with industry-focused stuff, what I note is that everyone's looking. Because they're, 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 you know, they're it's checking so it out. They're, they're exactly, so they're all going... It's a good look. It's a good look. <laughs> it might be the most amazing look ever. They might be looking and thinking, oh my God, that's the best thing I've ever seen ever. But you don't know that when you're on the stage. I All you see is... Well, I, wanna, I just want to know, how. what do you think of I Love Live? Other than the fact that there's industry people looking at you, what do you think of I Love Live I as love an event? Live, I think, as an event, I feel that I Love Live is a great platform for um, people who are trying to be seen. Um, by the relevant people. Um, I also feel as though, I mean, I also feel as though it's one of those showcases that has quite a broad spectrum of performers from people that are signed um, to established to um, kind of like people who were just coming through and they're quite a supportive bunch, I feel. So it's really, it's really nice to be uh, here and be accepted into the fold and uh, finally be performing. It's good to have you. So just let us know what's coming up for you for the rest of the year. Uh, well, I released an EP at the top of the year, and um, uh, we did a. Um, we've done. I've done a couple of videos now. We've done a couple of videos for a couple of the tracks on the EP, um, and I'm planning one more video for a track called "She Cries," um, which I'd, I'm going to be putting out as a charity single, um, and it will have some remixes on there. We're going to try and make it a little bit interesting in terms of like for people to sort of get involved in and, and look at and, and absorb. Um, but effectively, it's just a song um, that I would really like the message of to get out. So just going to work artistically and creatively and trying to make it really amazing and touch people. So yeah, that's, that's, that's pretty much it for the rest of the year for me. Lovely. Well, it's been great having you here. I can't wait to see your performance. It's been Baby Soul, Ramal London, I Love Live TV. Yay.